Good morning, guys. It is Saturday today. I know a very rarely vlog on Saturday. Yeah, but today is a special party. It's Mike's party today. So I thought I'd vlog. I don't think there's really that many preparations to be done. So, um, yeah, I just thought I'd vlog. Uh, last night was date night. It was lovely. We went out for a Turkish dinner and it was delicious. Um, my brother and his girlfriend looked after the children and yeah, it was so nice to get out. We had no social media, no phones. It was just very, very chill. And we had conversation, which was amazing. Um, we, Mike's just making breakfast now. He came down with the kids this morning. I had a little bit of a lion, which is lovely. Um, I'm just waiting for a gardening guy to come around to give us a quote on some fences and boring stuff like that. Um, but yeah, everybody's had a bottle, haven't you? Did Daddy give you a bottle? Yeah. And Daddy gives Jeremy a bottle. Cool. And yeah, now we're making some breakfast, so pretty good start to the day. It's the most amazing thing to see, but Harrison and Emily have such a cool relationship. It's so lovely. Harrison is the best big brother ever. Like, I say it, and I've said it in the past, but honestly, he's amazing. It is Daddy's party, yes. Um, but he, like, if she's crying, he'll walk into the room and she'll stop. And he knows how to calm her. It's just, he's amazing, and Emily is absolutely obsessed with him. She just follows him around the room. Obviously not literally, like, with her eyes. Um, yeah, she loves him. Yeah, it's just a serious one. Is it? Yeah, I don't want to watch it. Okay, then. It has some just box. jobs I need to do today for my birthday. Um, I really want to get him a big like 30 bloom because I've arranged him like a um <laughs> you got H? Uh, a map. A map? A map of what? Okay. What is that a map of? Uh, the holiday. Tenerife. Yeah. <laughs> guy has just been to look at the garden and he's going to give us like quotes on everything which is helpful just want it like sorted for the summer but we had a very busy morning plan so mike's gonna crack on with some breakfast we need a coffee and then we're off to mike's mum to get sorted so we need to make a bit of a start on some editing i've fallen a bit behind on a daily vlog <laughs> a daily vlog so i've not really fallen behind but normally i'm used to like yeah yeah, I'm used to filming and uploading in the same day. Um, but because I had a little bit of groundwork this week, which I'm really grateful for. Oh dear. <laughs> um, I've kind of been busy doing that. So, um, yeah, I need to crack on doing that now. So now I'm in the other room. I can talk to you a little bit better. Because um, I can tell you the secrets. So for this evening, I've organised like a um, like a photo mirror. Um, somebody was talking about them on holiday, and I was like, "Oh, I need one of those." So the company is Picture Perfect Magic Mirror, um, and I think they're going to come for a couple of hours. And it's basically like a selfie mirror. I think it just is a lot more spacious, or saves a lot more space than getting like a photo booth. Um, and it just gives Mike the opportunity to take pictures of everyone through 30 if um, the people that he might not necessarily normally have photos with and it's just a nice you're right there <laughs> it's nice to look back on isn't it um, cake I've got to go and pick up the cake shortly fortunately um, obviously my best friend Nikki is the most amazing baker ever um, I'll leave her Instagram below she's incredible and she makes all of our cakes, like all of Harrison's cakes in the past and my cakes and just all the cake that you see on my stories. Um, so she's made Mike, I think, a Bonoffi birthday cake. I think cookie dough brownies or something and red velvet cupcakes. So I'm sure they'll go down very, very well. So yeah, I've got to pick them up too. I've got to go and set up like the marquee bit at Mike's mum's house soon. Yeah. Who else? I don't even know what else I've got to do. I know that I've got to get this video edited, so let's crack up with that. Cause otherwise, I won't be doing anything. Emily, you're going to learn to edit so you can do mummy's videos. You want to learn to edit so you can do mummy's videos. So 
But this is what we call multitasking. Do you love it? Yeah. We're gonna decorate for Daddy's party. Yeah. Yay. Yeah. Yeah. All right, go on then. What are you doing? Yeah, I know it's hot. Be careful. Are you ready to party? Yeah. Woohoo! So I'm on a panic trip to Hobbycraft to bloom. All of this party stuff is making me want to party. Ha <laughs> ah. ha! That's cool. I love these blooms. Let me try and find some silver or gold. <laughs> Dad, you look like you're about to fly away. Hide your head. Probably breaking some kind of driving rule. Um, in fact, I'm pretty sure I am. I think I may possibly float away. Panic over, Dad to the rescue. Um, my dad came to rescue me because I literally couldn't see out of a single mirror. So it's taken two cars to get these balloons to the party. But they're really nice balloons. So yeah. Don't tell Mike, because I should be party planning, party arranging, but um, I'm going to pop into Next because they've got their sale. So I've just come out of Next and of course I could not help myself, um, I've treated myself with some bedside tables, um, but they were in the sale, they were a lot cheaper than they should have been. Um, now I just have to explain to Mike how, how they came about when I was on the balloon run. <laughs> they explained to Mike like he's going to care, he honestly will not care, he'll be like yeah cool. Um, I feel like me saying that people will come out being like, what? Um, but no, he'll be, he doesn't care. Um, but yeah, I feel like I've lost a balloon. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> She's not impressed. <laughs> okay. You like it? You want this for your birthday? Oh, you can't because you were born in December, it'd be too cold. So, back from Mike's mum and dad's house now. Um, everything's kind of set up, kind of ready to go. Uh, now we've rushed back home because I've got to get ready. Don't have a lot of time though. Oh god, today's been absolutely manic. Um, my battery's died, so I've not been able to get in touch with the lady to sort out the photo thing. Oh my goodness, some of the balloons deflated, which is so annoying. Um, yeah. Anyway, we will have drinks and we'll have food and we'll have lots of fun, I'm sure. And the little things people won't even notice. Um, but anyway, I'm going to get ready. Get Harrison ready, get Evelyn ready. Mike can get himself ready. I really need to wash my hair, but you know when you you just don't have the time. I'm like, oh, can I get away with it? But I don't think I can. What's it? What's it? What's it? What's it? Um, I've chucked on some makeup, but I am going to quickly just chuck some heated rollers through my hair because it's looking, <laughs> I didn't wash it, it's looking a little bit greasy. Um, oh god. So, I've gone for the rollers, um, and I think I'm going to have to use the whole thing to dry shampoo. Because I just couldn't be bothered to wash my hair, it's just too much effort when you've got two kids to get ready, and you're in a bit of a rush as it is. So yeah, who cares anyway, it's night time. One, oh, come on. two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You all ready for the party, Everly? And Harrison, you're both ready? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. Party, party, party. Party, party, party. So I'm just waiting for Mike now, the birthday boy. Um, he's just finishing getting ready and then we are going to head off. We've decided to get a cab home tonight too, which means that mummy can go wild too for once. Um, I mean, I'm far from wild. I've never been wild. Mummy's never been a wild one, Baba. One or two drinks is enough for me. Um, but yeah, looking forward to tonight. Are you looking forward to it? Let's go, guys. Oh. We're ready, I've got my bag of stuff. Oh my god, people you go out, out to take 10 million things, right? Huh? Let's go. Oh, I really like 
I know this is gonna sound so incredibly lame, but when you're going out for the second time in a week, Wow, it's cool, isn't it, Harrison? Yeah. You like it? Yeah, this is this where it's on the car? Yeah. What? Say cheese. Cheese. Make a wish as well, have a yeah. <laughs> So it is about half past two in the morning. Mike's brother has just dropped myself, um, Mike, not Mike, Harrison and Evelyn. And yeah, it is very late and I'm very, 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 very tired. So I'm going to go and call into bed. Harrison is in my bed. Evelyn is asleep. Um, but it was a lovely night. It was such a nice night. Mike is still partying on um he's staying out tonight so yeah I'm gonna see him tomorrow and yeah clocks are going forward backwards whatever but all I know is I lose out on that hour so I'm gonna grab myself some water and get to bed <laughs> Good morning guys, it is the morning after, it's Sunday morning today and, well actually I say it's Sunday morning, it isn't, it's 1.57. Um, and you, you're very late at, at family's house at daddy's part again, guess what, what day it was? It was Sunday when we came home. Yeah. What? That was a late night. Um, Everly woke up at 9.30. And we went at... What number did we go at? We got home at about 2.30. Oh. No. Oh, we went on Saturday and we came home on Sunday. Party animals. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, it's been pretty chill. I am absolutely shattered though. Um, oh, dear. Evelyn's awake. Yeah. Uh oh. <laughs> I've just been pottering around, tidying up and stuff, just getting jobs done. Um, just tidying up the bedroom because when, apparently when you go out for two nights in a row, which hasn't happened for a very, 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 very long time, um, the getting ready mess accumulates. I remember like back in the day when I'd go out, out, I'd come home and my bed would just be covered in like making up and hair stuff and clothes. Apparently the same now. Anyway, I'm going to try and put this frame up. Well, I say try. I can put a frame up. I'm going to put that up there. I need to go and get the tools and stuff from the shed. Um, yeah, I just want to get a few jobs done. I've got to go out as well and get some formula because I'm running late. So I've got to do that soon because it's Sunday and Sunday trading and all of that. Which I can't actually believe is still a thing, really. But never mind. He laid down and it hurt himself. Alison, what game are you playing? People can't turn on their own Ow! Oh, fire. Good morning, party animal. <laughs> Good morning, party animal. You all right? I said, Good morning, party animal. <laughs> Happy Sunday. Good morning, party animal. Emily's very happy today. I think she liked the party. I think you had fun, didn't you, seeing all the people? Because you're very, very nosy. Myself and Evelyn are just chilling, watching Harrison play, aren't we, dude? Yes. Whoa, that's a good line. No, this His imagination is wild. I love it. Sorry, I'm just laying on my bed playing with Evelyn. Um, but it's so nice to have really like slow days sometimes, isn't it? Just doing nothing, even if you feel horrendous. It's so nice just to like stay in your slouchy clothes and just do nothing but listen to Disney soundtracks and play with the kids on the floor. Um, although I have just booked a table at the Carvery so I really want to roast dinner. I need to soak up, soak up the, the vile feelings. <laughs> and there we go. You like that, don't you? You like that? 
Littlest has fallen asleep finally. That took a little bit of work. Um, yeah, our table's booked for an hour. So I'm gonna tidy up downstairs and then quickly jump in the shower. I'm not getting ready past like washing um, because it's Sunday for a start and I can't be bothered. So I'm showered now, chucked on comfy clothes and trainers, chucked my greasy hair up and we are ready to go and eat. Mike's just walked in. Um, I think he's going and feeling a little bit worse for wear. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully a nice roast dinner will sort that out because I know it will for me. And I feel like I ate so much I could fall asleep now. Do you feel better, Mike? A little bit. Where are you going? <laughs> <laughs> She's like, wild. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Did you see that, Harrison? What? Yeah. <laughs> that man was in his own world. <laughs> um, we are now off to, to go to Mike's parents' house to pick up the pram. We left it there last night. Um, and then home, I want to have a bubble bath Daddy. with a blast. I've got a lush bath bob at home with my name on it. I'm gonna have a nice relax. Dad, and guess what, guys? I need to edit a video. And guess what, guys? Guess what, guys? Come on. Uh, when Daddy was in the road and he got down the road, walking by, and we all laughed. <laughs> well, we did, didn't we? <laughs> well, we all did apart from Emily. So, yeah, we're off to go pick up the buggy and then hi. Got the milk, thank goodness. Um, yeah. I feel like having a late night and a bit, well, not a lie in, having a late night and the children having a lie in on British summer, spring forward day. Oh, not fun at all. Summer doesn't care about parents. Clearly. So Harrison is in bed. Everly has just had her bath and now she's having her bottle. And I think that bedtime is on the horizon. I've edited my video. I just need to have my bath now and wash this greasy hair. I can't even believe I've vlogged with her like this. Um, but yeah, I feel good knowing that bedtime is in sight because it's been a well no it's been a tiring day it's been well no it has been a tiring day i've been tired but we haven't done anything um but i think the last couple of nights have caught up and i am so ready to sleep for like eight hours 